Welcome back to the channel and yes, what have the Romans ever done for us? They've left us this. Lullington Roman Villa remains in care of English heritage, which I've just rejoined again because I've got a bit of discount. Absolutely spectacular, one of the best preserved Roman villas in the country. The scene is taken from Greek I'm just near Ainsford, where I was here two years ago when I went to Ainsford Castle nearby and did a walk around the village, so I'll link those videos below. And unfortunately we can't go to Ainsford Castle again because there's structural damage due to uh, vandalism because um, it's an open access uh, place, which is a real shame. What's the matter with people? I have a question, a couple of skeletons here, one of a baby, one of a man of about 24. I don't know how you feel about this, I feel a bit uncomfortable when I see skeletons because why aren't they buried? Because someone died 2,000 years ago, it doesn't really mean anything to someone who died yesterday. Why don't they bury them? Amazing, it's so well preserved, so well preserved. I don't know why I didn't come here last time I was in Ainsford. I hope that got that correction correct, how I've pronounced that, Ainsford, not Ainsford, Ainsford. little film in a minute being played about the history of this uh, area and I might, uh, might just watch that and then take it down to a little church Fascinating look round Lullington Roman Villa. Some stages of early Christianity was worshipped uh, in these old villas as the old pagan gods were wiped out and the new religion came in. Absolutely fascinating. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go and buy some mead, because they've got mead here, it's English heritage, I love English heritage, traditional mead, and uh, pop along to our next location. Ladies and gentlemen, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's good we're doing things inside today because it hadn't stopped raining this morning. I knew it was going to, but I think it's going to clear up about midday. We've got a pub lunch over at The Plough uh, in Ainsford. incredible tombs here 
absolutely fantastic. Here lies Sir George Hart, uh, second son of Sir Percival Hart Knight. Oh, sorry, George Hart Knight, second son of Percival Hart Knight, who died uh, 16th of July, 1587. 1587. And over the back there is Sir John Pichet. Oh, is it Pichet pronounced? Who um, did a lot for L Lullington Castle. Oh, here's a oh, look at this. Uh, here lies the body of William Hart Esquire, the eldest son of Sir Percival Hart, who died on uh, 1 and 30, so 31st of March. 1671, age 77. Lovely little shrine, absolutely lovely. These are interesting. So are they tombs underneath the floor? It could be, we're on a bit of a raised platform. Wow. Absolutely fascinating, these tombs. Absolutely fascinating. And just a tad eerie. You know, that's just psychology kicking in, but it, yeah, a little bit creepy. But uh, absolutely gorgeous. It says this is the parish church of Lullington. It's not a private chapel. You'd think it could be a private chapel, but it's not. Another little fact about this church, it has some of the earliest stained glass windows in the country in a church. Some of the earliest, and they do look old. They do look old. Yeah, some of the paint sort of uh, washed off a little bit. So thank you, some Boltov Church. Absolutely fascinating, quite a unique looking church as well, especially with the, uh, the tombs, absolutely amazing. So what we're going to do now, head back down to Ainsford, have I pronounced that correctly, and we're going to have lunch at The Plough, which is just by the river, the ford by the river, if those who know the area. Uh, let's go. Where you were when the blinds pulled down You love it when nobody's around I want to call out pound town But you bite my lip, don't make a sound I'll be down if I'm leaving without you Yours, I'll take what's left. We used to come in a circle best. Well, that was a very nice meal at the Plough. Very enjoyable, very tasty, lovely staff. Thank you. So, there you go Lunnington Roman Villa and the church. Just a short little video today. Although it's been really grim with the weather, but hey, we've been inside, so it's been fine. So, I hope you've enjoyed it. Please do the old like, subscribe, all the normal stuff, and we'll see you next time. Take care. Mm -hmm.